Afternoon everyone. Today uh, I gotta do a couple things with the plow. First I gotta uh, go plow out the driveway into my shop, which I have not plowed that out in a uh, long time because I haven't been in there. I needed to be in there, so it's been about two weeks I think it is, so there's a lot of snow there. And the reason why I've gotta get it plowed out is because I gotta be able to get in and out of there to uh, finish up my lawnmowers before spring. So it's supposed to start raining tonight and continue on for the next two days. So I can't take a chance on that snow not melting and then piled up where I cannot get into it until spring. Because I've just got too much to do. So anyhow, uh, let's go hit that driveway. Takes care of that driveway. Problem with that is there's no real place to push that, so you kind of kind of work it off both sides, more on the one side than the other side. But there's just no room there anywhere for to push any snow. But uh, if I got in there with a snowblower and snowblowed it all out, it'd be one thing. But uh, to get in there with a the plow, it, it's kind of a pain in the butt. But since I haven't been there so long. Um, to bust through the first uh, little section by the opening of the driveway it was all solid brick of ice there so it's been a long time since I've been there so let's go uh, to this parking lot and see what I could do with this I'm just trying to get back uh, one parking spot that is uh, snows too far out in I should be able to get 
uh, most all of it pushed back enough where it would be fine till uh, the next two storms after that. Okay, that little area in the parking lot is done. I just wanted to get that one parking spot back because uh, parking in this parking lot is at a premium. A lot of parking in there. Anyhow, um, this should make it through the rest of the year without a problem unless we get some more storms like we've had this past month where we get 10 to 12 inches in three different events, uh, which is unheard of for our area, but it happens once in a while. So there's been some questions on and off every now and then, I guess, however you want to say it. Uh, about how I plow and uh, questions of is there a right way and a wrong way. There's not really a wrong way to do it unless you're breaking something and that was the wrong way to do it, but um, you plow whatever works best for you. And you know, what works best for me might not be best for you. And you may not like the way I do things and I may not like the way you do things. It's just whatever you're comfortable with and whatever you think is best. Yeah, it's kind of vague. It's probably not an answer you wanted, but um, the one question was, uh, can you angle a blade when you're uh, back dragging? Well, absolutely you can, because I do it all the time. And it all, when you're plowing, you're doing whatever you got to do to get the job done. And you're trying to be as efficient as possible, and you're also trying not to beat on your truck and break things. And it's uh, kind of a little bit of a trial and error on every brand new driveway that you get to, to figure out how the best way to plow it is. And you may be plowing that thing for three, four different storms, and then all of a sudden you realize, well, that was all wrong the way I was doing it. I should have been doing another one. That happens frequently. And if someone says it's never happened to them, uh, they're probably lying, because I'm sure it's happened to everybody. So I just want to mention a little bit of a few of them things, because, uh, you know, the questions are there. People want to know. People are curious. And that's the way we learn things, is you ask questions. No such thing as a dumb question, just a dumb answer. So um, that's pretty much all I've got for you today. I got everything opened up that I need to get open, especially my shop, because I got a lot of work to do. I keep saying that, but there's a lot of work to be done yet. So uh, that is going to be the end of my video for today. I thank you for watching and subscribing. And you can check out the links in the description box below. It would be greatly appreciated. And everybody have a good evening, and we will see you on the next one.